Hi, my name is Raquel and I'm starring in a Mattel creative video. Today, we're building the Barbie Dream House. This step-by-step -step guide should help make the assembly stress-free. Before starting assembly, you'll want to take out your instruction sheet and lay out all your pieces. Spreading them out makes assembly much easier. For this next step, we're gonna need a Phillips head screwdriver and three AA batteries. This is where the batteries go. Unscrew the battery door. Now place the three batteries inside. Then replace the door and screw shut. Great, now that we see that the lights and the sounds are working properly, we can start to assemble the house. We'll start with the main structure first, then add furniture and accessories later. Let's start with the first floor. Find the three floor pieces. First, find the square piece with connection point labeled 1C. Connect it to the left side of the docking piece. It's also labeled 1C. Just line up over the connector point and snap. Then repeat on the right side for piece with connection point labeled 1D. Next, we're gonna add some rooms to the first floor. First, snap the pink piece labeled 1G into the floor on the left side. This will be the living room. Next, snap the pink piece with the pink door labeled 1F into the middle dock. Check out that cute little doggy door. Finally, snap the blue piece labeled 1E into the floor on the right side. This is the kitchen. Now let's add some support beams. Snap the three light pink columns with the label B into the square holes at the front of the floor. Next, you will build the second floor. There are three pink floor pieces here as well. Add the rectangular piece with a bed labeled 2A above the living room on the left side. Make sure you press until you hear a click so that it's fully assembled. Then, add the other pink floor labeled 2B by snapping above the kitchen to the right of the front door. Finally, let's add the middle pink floor right above the door. All snapped. Next, let's complete the second floor. Take the two light pink columns and snap them into the floor. Next, add in the staircase labeled 2F into the floor. Now we add the walls to the second floor. Snap the bedroom wall labeled 2G behind the bed on the left side to complete Barbie's bedroom. Next, snap the closet wall labeled 2E into the middle section to create Barbie's closet. Lastly, snap the bathroom wall labeled 2D in place to the right to create Barbie's bathroom. How cute is that? Let's take it up another level and add the third floor. First, add the green rounded floor piece labeled 3A on top of the bedroom, snapping it into the wall and the light pink column. Be sure that you hear the snap noise to ensure that the floor is securely in place. Next, add the pink rectangular piece labeled 3B over the bathroom, snapping it into the walls and the column. Finally, you can snap the middle pink piece labeled 3C right in the middle above the closet. Now for the final floor. First, snap the back wall of the slumber party room labeled 3F into the floor on the right side. Now you're ready to snap on your support beams for the elevator. Take the long piece with the label 3E up on the top and snap it into the pink floors on each floor. You can tell the long pieces apart because this piece has a small pink extension up at the top. This one should go into the front. Take the second light pink elevator column with the label 3D at the top. Unfold and connect it to the back, snapping it into the pink floors on each level. Now it's time to add the elevator. There are four elevator pieces to construct. First, take the pink elevator floor and connect the pink wall with the door. Next, connect the single pink wall with the puppy paw to the front to create the little elevator for Poppy 2. Finally, connect all three pieces with the pink elevator frame. Now you can connect the elevator at the bottom of the shaft. Make sure that you snap in both the front and back sides and hear the snap on all columns. After the elevator is installed, snap in the top of the elevator column to join the two elevator columns. Time to add the final details. First, snap the purple dolphin railing into the green balcony floor and put your palm tree pieces together and snap it into the back of the green floor. Make sure you add your blue string lights, attaching one side to the palm tree and the other side to the pink wall. 
Finally, for the third floor, you can snap in the pink roof labeled 4B to the top of the slumber party room wall and elevator shaft to create the roof. Feels like home already. Let's finish up the second floor. Snap in the white closet wall so Barbie has a place to hang up all her clothes. Next, add in the toilet and shower door to finish up the bathroom. Now, let's head outside. First, snap the green piece label 1L into the pink floor on the left side of the house and attach the pink support post to the other end. You can also insert the little blue puppy pole into the green piece or move it around so puppy can have fun anywhere. Finally, don't forget to check out the back side of the house and attach the two pink supports on each side. And now for the part that your child is going to love, the giant pink spiral slide. You'll want to build the slide in two pieces starting with piece label S0 at the top and S1 at the bottom to the piece label S1 at the top. Put this down to the side as you build the second half of the slide. Starting with the piece label S2 at the top and S3 at the bottom, connect this to the piece that has S3 at the top and S4 at the bottom. And lastly, connect these pieces to the piece label S4 on the top. Then, you can go ahead and attach the first half you built to the green balcony piece on the third floor. Then connect in the middle to the second half of the slide that you built, which attaches to the top of the pink post. Finally, flip up the little pink support on the side of the house to support the bottom of the slide. And don't forget the pool. And if you want more space to play, you can always detach the slide and retach it later. Time to add the finishing touches. Each label is numbered in the instruction sheet so you know exactly where to put them. With more than 75 fun accessories, you can set the stage for every story. Now your dream house is complete. We did it! There are tons of fun ways to play. Press down on the elevator button and slide to the second and third floors. This house has so many unique touches, including surprise transformations. There is a second bed under Barbie's bed, and the console on the third floor transforms into an extra bed to sleep two dolls. There are also lots of places for Puppy to play too, including a bed and a house just for Puppy. There are even realistic lights and sounds throughout the house. <laughs> there is so much to love about this house. Thank you so much for watching this Mattel created video. Bye.